Hey Techno Studs, in this module, we're gonna be talking about security. Now, even though it's one of the last topics of this course, this is probably one of the most important topics. We've waited till the end to cover this because there's a lot of information that you need to know to understand some of these security topics. But now that you know them, let's get into security and why security is so important. Over the course of my career, I've really gained an appreciation for security and realized the importance that security has within all your, net, your networks and really anything when it comes to IT. And here's the reason why. Over time, what happens is if you have some sort of incident, there's a recovery for that incident. And let's use an example of, let's say your system goes down and it lasts maybe one hour and all of the users that are using your system or trying to use your system during that hour, it's impactful for. And there's a little bit of follow-up that happens afterwards to mitigate that and to make sure your customers are satisfied again or make sure your users are satisfied again. So, but let's take the same, uh, a similar incident, but let's say it only happens for 15 minutes and it's a security incident. And it's a security incident where you had a breach and somebody downloaded information. Once that information is downloaded, it is now out there in the world and you can never fully recover or never fully be satisfied that it's it's been 100% completely deleted. And so really the repercussions from this could last for ages after the security incident. Of course, it's gonna be most impactful right after the security incident. And let me tell you, the cleanup that happens after a security incident, after there's been a breach or after there's been some sort of exposure, it really does, there you have to get lawyers involved and you have to get uh, do notifications that go out to customers. And it can be very, very, very impactful to the company, even if the breach was pretty minor. And so it is really important that whatever you do with these with your networks is that you treat security as your number one priority. So the first thing that we're gonna do is we're actually going to define what is security and really get a good definition of what security is. Then we're gonna get into some key security concepts. And really what this first part of this is, is just establishing what does a security program look like and what are some overall big scoping ideas behind security. We'll talk about vulnerability, we'll talk about threat management, we'll talk about social engineering techniques and risk management and some basic security principles. So really what we're getting into here is once again, just a real broad overview of what a security program looks like and what you should be thinking about when it comes to security. But then we get into specific security topics around networking, some common networking security vulnerabilities, some how to secure your network, how to harden your equipment so that it's less susceptible and less prone to being hacked or any kind of security issues. We'll talk about passwords and what makes a good password. We'll talk about remote access. We'll get into some firewall and access control lists, and then we'll wrap things up by talking about wireless security.